Hi guys, nandito tayo sa saluting battery dito sa Baleta. Opo, explore ko po kayo. Ano po ba meron dito sa saluting battery sa Baleta? Tingnan natin. Ito po matatagpuan ito sa upper baraka. Yung taas upper baraka. May makikita kang hagdan pa baba. So ito yung makikita mo. Saluting battery. Dito tayo sa loob. Hi, good morning ma'am. So, nakasulat din dito may sign papuntang Las Caris War, so, war Rooms. So, ikutin muna natin. Ano ba meron dito? Ayan. Yung mga lumang kanyo na nakadisplay dito na ginamit pa noong gera. Noong... 1939 hanggang 1942 o 43 ito yung mga example ng mga bala sa kanyon example lang yan, hindi po yan totoo so dito sa taas, dito sa pinunta natin sa saluting battery so makikita natin yung baba yung baba Oo. May malit na moske. Kapag yan po yung binaybay nyo sa baba. <laughs> Ang tawag na dyan waterfront. Waterfront na po yan. Sandali. Ito yung kanyon eh. Nakaharang. Pakita ko sa inyo. Yung yung kabila na yan. Yan yan yan. Yan, yan sentro. Yung diretso na yan. Yan po yung birgo. Yung nasa kaliwa Ah, yung nasa kanan Sorry Yung nasa kanan na yan Yan yung isla At yung doon naman sa kaliwa na yun Yung diretso na yun Hindi ko na isusum kasi ano to eh Ang gamit ko kasi GoPro Hindi ko maisum Hindi katulad ng Android o iPhone na gamit Pwede kong isum Yung nandoon sa kabila na yun Yung yung kalkara So Nandito tayo sa saluting battery. Ayan yung mga nag ano. Nagsasalut. Mm, ganyan sila. Mm. Bye, na natin. namimiss ko yung C80 sana sa Pilipinas ibalik ulit yung C80 no? yung ROTC yung mga COCC na tinatawag nung high school para may exercise yung mga kabataan kasi parang feeling ko pinalitan na na ng mobile legend eh. ayan yung taas yung taas na yan nakikita nyo yung mga tao na yan ano yan yan yung upper baraka So nandito tayo sa baba kasi nandito tayo sa uh, saluting battery ng baleta na kung saan ito yung ginagamit nilang pwesto nung panahon ng gera paano nila didepensahan yung Malta o yung bansa nila itong kanyo na to totoo yan hindi na yan replika totoo yan yung lang mga bala na yun yung pinakita ko kanina ito mga to totoong kanyon talaga yan pinreserve nila yan mga ilang taon na itong nakadisplay dito sa baleta isa ito sa pinupuntahan ng mga turista na dumadayo at pumupunta rito sa baleta itong in-explore ko sa inyo itong ipinapasyal ko sa inyo Yan, yan, yan yung uh, waterfront yun yung lift magmula sa upper baraka pa baba hmm. pag baba mo dyan waterfront na po dyan yan. yung ano na sakaya na ng peris hmm. yan. Yan. 
sa mga nanonood ng video na ginagawa ko please kindly subscribe and comment nyo lang po kung saan po nakarating yung video yung ginagawa ko yung pinapakita ko para malaman ko rin po sa mga sa mga patuloy na tumutulong at sumusuporta sa akin maraming maraming salamat po sa tulong at gabay na ibinibigay nyo sa akin mm -mm. Sa mga gustong mag-comment, please kindly comment below. Para malaman ko kung ano po yung natutunan nyo at gusto nyo pang ipalabas ko sa mga video ginagawa ko. Good morning ladies Hanggang... and gentlemen and welcome to the saluting battery in the beautiful city of Valletta. This is a ceremonial defensive platform from which we fire a cannon at 12 o'clock and at 4 o'clock for timekeeping purposes. So if you're interested in the saluting battery and the firing at 12 o'clock, if you'd like to obtain a personal and up close experience with the firing of the gun, the closest you can ever get to witnessing the firing of a real live cannon, all you have to do is book your tickets at the main reception area behind the fountain via the stairs. The next museum site open for exploration is the Lascaris War Rooms. They are situated 45 meters underneath the upper Baraka Gardens, and they were used as the pivotal launching point for the Allied invasion of Sicily in July 1943. So they comprised various operation rooms, and they were also considered a closely guarded secret during wartime Malta, Malta's best kept secret. Eisenhower spent five days and five nights in the war room, so a visit offers a historical deep dive into Malta's wartime history and also allows you to follow in the footsteps of notable allied figures. For a more comprehensive experience, you can request multilingual audio guides, audio guides in any languages, and also there's an next guided tour starting at 10.30. There's also the War Headquarters Tunnel Store, ladies and gentlemen, starting at 10.30 as well. The tunnels were originally built by the Knights of St. John and they're located 40 meters underground within the St. Peter's St. Paul Bastion. They were then expanded by the British and leveraged by NATO. So they played a pivotal role in safeguarding Malta against the adversaries of both the Second World War and the Cold War. If you're interested in an underground adventure and Cold War intrigue, all you have to do is come down to the saluting battery main reception area and book your tickets for the guided tour at 10.30. There's also the Tang Gun Museum, ladies and gentlemen, which was a local former garrison church crypt. There you can witness navigation instruments, various pieces of artillery and period uniforms. So once again, ladies and gentlemen, we thank you very much for your attention. We're about to fire at 12 o'clock on the dot, and we hope you have a wonderful day here in the beautiful city of Valletta. Okay, brother and sister, thank you so much. Thanks for watching. God bless us. God bless us po sa ating lahat. <laughs>